Hello everyone, Greg here. Time to talk about something that makes most people very uncomfortable. Racism. If you haven't noticed, I'm a white guy. And to some people, that means that I'm responsible for all the bad shit that happens, ever. Well, let's take a quick look at the majority of white Americans. Most of them immigrated here in the late 1800s, being very poor and looking for a better life. Thousands of these immigrants were tricked into joining the Union Army, so they were not only fighting to preserve the Union, but to end slavery. From my own personal family experience, we got here about early 1900s. They made their way to the Midwest, where it resembled the lands that they came from, Scandinavia, except that it had a Bill of Rights and a Constitution, kind of the best of both worlds there. So, a majority of white people their ancestors had no slaves. Hmm. Yeah, but what about the horrible act the white people did, the Europeans did, during the slave trade, huh? What about that? Yeah, that blows. But weren't there, like, uh, several African tribes that were fighting amongst each other constantly, uh, enslaving each other before Europeans ever got there? Uh... Weren't they constantly accepting bribes and selling each other out and even helping catch other tribes? Uh, well, I gotta go. Hmm. I see. Anyway, and this is not to say that there were not beautiful African kingdoms, okay? There were. They were definitely on par with other European and Middle Eastern kingdoms and Asian kingdoms throughout history. Every, I think every continent has had its golden age, right? Every race has had a golden age, right? A huge change came after the Civil War. Slavery was no longer legal. Hmm. And anyone will tell you that it's not easy for a human being to change overnight. Things still sucked super hardcore for black people in the South and all over the United States. I guess my point is that a majority of white people, white ancestors in the United States, did not own slaves and had nothing to do with slavery. Even the Confederate soldiers, they weren't fighting to preserve the rights of the rich plantation owners. They were fighting to preserve the right of their state to make up their own minds over federal law. That was the big point of the Civil War when it started. So after that, generations really sucked to be black in America. Would never deny that. Shit does not change overnight, like I just said. But there was a movement. There was like a big movement. People were marching. Ah, what was it called? A civil rights movement. Yeah, that's what it was called. And that started a wave of minorities and women to get rights that they hadn't had before. Very basic human rights that are awesome that they fought for. Things got better. Never perfect. When's it ever going to be perfect? But things got better, and they're still getting better. So why in the last 30 years or so have things been starting to move backwards? Hmm. What happened 30 years ago that shocked not only the nation, but the black community specifically? Hmm. Was it white men capturing black people as slaves again? Uh, no. Was it making black people sit in segregation again? Uh, no. Was it lynching black people while applauding? No. Let's take a quick look at the number of black people arrested and incarcerated in the 20th century. And what was it? What happened about 30 years ago? Hmm. What happened in the 80s that would have caused such, such an intense rise in black arrests and incarcerations? Some of that crack? Some of that gangster rap? Well, that wasn't white people making it, selling it, getting caught with it. We certainly weren't involved in gangster rap, which encouraged an entire generation to say fuck the police, to resist arrest, thinking selling drugs is awesome, aspiring to be criminals. All right, so things sucked certain times, points in US history, hmm, but as a nation, haven't we been moving forward? Generation after generation, aren't we moving forward? Why are some movements trying to open up old wounds? Why are they trying to make us move backwards? Because some people need to be pitied. 
some people need to be the victim. And as a white male, it's all my fault. Well, that's my racist vid. Time to go out and enslave another race and get free shit. Because we're white. Go fuck yourself. Gotta fix my fucking... Gotta fix my fucking do, bro. Nappy. Okay.